News flash. Did you know that Brita water does not filter out your chlorine? I know so many people, I was just in the drive through today at the coffee shop talking to the gal, and she's like, oh yeah, I use Brita filter, the, pil the pitcher that we get from Costco. I'm like, oh, I'm just gonna be doing a video today on that filter. So that's what we did. We went to Costco, we bought the Brita filter. It cost us about $40 to get this little guy right here. We've used it a couple times just to see if there was chlorine and there is chlorine. So I wanna expose it today so I can show you that these so-called filters are not doing the job. So before I get started with that, let's talk about chlorine. So where did chlorine come from? Chlorine is a gas that was invented in World War I to kill people in the concentration camps. So it was gas to the prisoners and then they died because of chlorine poisoning, toxicity. Now it's in our water system. And it's in there for a good reason. It's in there to kill the bacteria. The EPA regulates it and it's mandated to be in your water supply. So then we're drinking chlorine gas, which is gonna kill our good gut bacteria. As you might know, we have two brains. We have a gut brain and we have a brain up here. These two communicate. So when you don't have enough good gut bacteria, your brain cannot absorb serotonin and dopamine and all those other neurotransmitters because you don't have the good gut bacteria. So that's because we're killing it with chlorine. On top of that, one of my good friends, Bob Wright, he's the founder of the American Anti-Cancer Institute. You can find this book on my website, amandabobbitt.com. This is the Bible to anyone that does not wanna get cancer or has cancer and wants to know what really causes it and what to help your body do to help to balance itself. So he's gonna go through here and he's gonna talk about tap water, fluoride, chlorine. He's gonna talk about the acid alkaline balance of the body. He's gonna talk about restructured ionized water. That's what we have. He's gonna talk about all of these other things, mammograms, coffee enemas, phyo, visualization, all kinds of different things. So he's one of my good friends. He does have a video or two on my YouTube channel. So if you have not subscribed already to the YouTube channel, it's Amanda Bobbitt. But I wanna point out one thing here, just to add a little more credibility. Tap water, fluoride, and chlorine. I would never drink regular tap water unless it was an emergency. The story behind municipal water systems and the poisons that inhibit them would require an entire book to explain the document. Go see for yourself. The cancer risk among those drinking chlorinated water is 93% higher than those who do not. That's almost 100% if you drink chlorinated water, which is in our tap. And these Brita filters are not getting it out and we're paying for it. So what I'm gonna do here, I'm gonna take this almost brand new Brita filter and we're just gonna filter out this water here. That should be enough. So as you know, this Kangen device has seven different waters to choose from. So you can push a button and make water that's stronger than bleach. You can also find these at amandababa.com. So 2.5 water kills all bacteria and germs. Whereas we have 11.5, which pulls off the oil-based herbicides, pesticides, and fungicides. We have our beauty water, which we use every day. Tightens and tones our skin, age spots, moles, wrinkles, eczema, psoriasis. It's so awesome and great for your windows too. So we make all these different waters. So what we're gonna do here, we're gonna go back and we're gonna check to see if there's chlorine. So these are chlorine indicating drops. So if you're gonna check for chlorine in your pool, you're gonna use these. And you're gonna notice if you have a pool, there's algae that starts to grow. And then what do you do? You go to the pool store and say, here's my water sample, help me. They're gonna say, oh, get some bleach, put it in there, it's gonna kill everything. Or get some chlorine, because it's very similar to bleach and it's gonna kill everything. That's what, that's what the chlorine does, but this indicates it, okay? So if it turns yellow, that means there's chlorine. And look at all, whoo we wow, that is all chlorine. Now we're gonna go over here to the Kangen water machine. And I wanna show you this hydrogen gas. A lot of people think the only reason to drink this water is just the alkalinity, but in fact, it's the hydrogen gas and the alkalinity and the absorption, they all work together. So if you're finding bottled water on the shelf and all you see is alkaline water, 
that's just one benefit, but it's not going to give your body the best of results. So see all the bubbles there? That is the hydrogen gas. That's why you want to get a unit so you can drink it fresh because it dissipates. So now you can see there's no chlorine. I want to do one more test here. We're just going to get the tap water fresh from the tap. The EPA only tests for 91 different contaminants, but so far to date, there's over 60,000 different contaminants that could be in our water supply. And we don't know how they actually interact with each other. So we don't know what chemical soup we're actually drinking. And there is the tap water. <laughs> so there you have it, Brita water exposed. It is not what you think it is. And if you do want to check your Brita, just go down to the pool store, get the little fill, get the little chlorine indicating drops here, or go to my website, and you can check. This is so crazy, isn't it? So what I recommend you do is ask us about how to get one of these in your home. We finance them for twenty to fifty-five dollars per month, and we do have zero turndown financing. So if you want better health and you want one of these units, it's a hundred percent tax deduction on your countertop. Message us today, and we'll be sure to get one on your countertop.